Hello, this is Steve Bigelow with the Candlestick Forum. Markets continue to hit all-time highs. The Dow traded lower most of the day on Friday, but then came back up and uh, closed near the high end of the range, still keeping us well above the uh, T-line. And the NASDAQ. Also doing kind of a J-hook pattern, which would imply more upside. Very simple trading rule that as long as you're trading above the T-line, the uptrend remains in progress. The sectors are still the electric vehicles, information tech, and then not a sector, but the patterns that are setting up are working effectively well. But let me go back to the electric vehicle sector for a little bit. Obviously, Tesla has brought to the uh, forefront the fact that electric, the electric car sector is not only acting strong now, but two major facets are that more people are expecting electric cars just for the, uh, oh, the uh, keeping the economy or the keeping the atmosphere clean, number one. And number two, the advances in lithium battery technology has made electric cars all that much more feasible. We are going to be doing a special report series concentrating on the electric vehicles for two reasons. One, for short-term trades, it's going to be very lucrative. And then for the people that want to hold long-term, this is probably the number one sector that is going to produce the most profits over the next couple of years. So Tesla, as you can see, is up 600% over the last 12 months. NIO has moved up nicely, doing a J-hook pattern, breaking out. NIO is going to be the Chinese Tesla. Probably has a lot more upside. So we're looking at cars in that or uh, stocks in that sector, like Kendai. Well, I think we have it on here. We're also buying the information tech, especially with ones that do have patterns. TUFN, classic pattern, fry pan bottom followed by a J hook pattern. That area is acting very strong. Kayla is doing a scoop pattern, indicating a slingshot effect. And I don't know why this thing is not advancing like it should. Pola is a wedge breakout. There's four or five stocks that are showing wedge breakouts. This is where you put the two plus two analysis to your, your visual analysis. Notice the trend kicker, a very strong bullish indication, which would also tell us if there's a strong bullish indication that this level is not going to act as resistance, we can see the pattern breakout of a of a wedge breakout. And whoops, that's just great. So with the NASDAQ in new highs, you want to take advantage of the sectors that are acting the strongest. So what we're uh, kind of uh, advocating this week is what we call our free sample. If you've been watching candlestick analysis and you wanna see more of the logic that is put into candlestick charts based upon human nature, try us for a two week free trial. And on top of that, we are going to be uh, doing a new extensive research uh, area in the electric cars using the charts to tell us which car or which sector I'm sorry, which uh, auto manufacturers in that sector are advancing faster than the others as far as their technology. So that's two major uh, facets. We're giving everybody a free, free trial for the next couple of weeks. And you're gonna be taking advantage of seeing what the research is that uh, shows which uh, auto manufacturers have the lead uh, in this, uh, this sector that's probably going to take over a large portion of the market 
over the next few years. That'll be it. We'll see you in the chat rooms.